officials in Carroll County are urging you to be on alert after a pair of raccoons have tested positive for rabies and one of them attacked a woman inside her home. WMER 2 News' Jeff Hager is more on what's going on out there in Carroll. Tucked at the north end of Main Street near Wilson Avenue in Sykesville, news of the attack has caught residents off guard. A rabid raccoon had you know, gone in someone's house and bit them. Joe Mancuso of the Carroll County Health Department says the animal displayed abnormally aggressive behavior. It kind of broke into the person's house. I'm not exactly sure the mechanism how it got in there. Maybe a doggy door or what have you could have broken through a screen. Uh, but the person that lived in there uh, heard her dogs kind of yelping and barking. And then sure enough, there's a rat, crazy raccoon and she got between them and got bitten. As the rabies program manager for the department, Mancuso says while well, a bite or scratch from a rabid animal is an urgent matter, it's not necessarily an emergency and treatment can begin days after exposure. He adds infected animals typically exhibit strange behavior. They could be extra hungry and they might be out during the daylight. I'm sure you've probably heard they only go out, out at night. But um, in general, yeah, if, they, if they're approaching you, there's, there's something going on. There could potentially be something going on there. So just, uh, you know, keep a distance. And uh, if you feel threatened, call your local animal control. In addition to raccoons, skunks, foxes, bats, and feral cats all can also become rabid. It's enough to make those who live here near the Sykesville attack take stock of their surroundings. It's a little disconcerting because I've got woods up here on the hill, so... Yeah, yeah, I, I will definitely keep a lookout. In Carroll County, Jeff Hager, WMAR 2 News. Boy, a raccoon recently found a quarter of a mile from the traffic circle right there on Old Tawny Town Road also tested positive for rabies. So if you or your children or your pets may have come in contact with either of these rabid animals, you are asked to call the Carroll County Control, the health department here. Here's their number, 410-876-1884 to assess whether you need treatment or not.